hello you're welcome how to solve this nice algebra equation solution from here from what we have here you can multiply this directly x times x that's x squared over also 5 times 5 we have 5 squared then equals to here 5 times 5 also we have 5 squared then divided by x squared the next step here we cross multiply x squared times x squared then equals to also here we have 5 squared times 5 squared then this also follows when we have a times a which you can write as a squared and this same thing multiplying you can write it as x squared or squared equals to here we have 5 squared or squared then from here we take the right hand side to the left hand side and this becomes x square or square minus five squared or squared then equals to zero here this follows when we have a square minus b square which is the same thing as a plus b into bracket open bracket a minus b this yeah a stand as x square and b standing as five square and what we have here becomes x square plus five square into brackets then open bracket x square minus five square Close bracket equals to zero here. That this year we have two possible cases. The first one x square plus five square equals to zero, or we have x square minus five square equals to zero here. Then solving from this side, this follows and we have a square plus b square. We the same thing as a plus b i into brackets also open bracket a minus b i that is here all we have becomes x plus 5 i into brackets and open bracket x minus 5 i those brackets equals to zero here then here we have two possible cases the first one x plus 5 i equals to zero or we have x minus five i equals to zero here then here we have x equals to minus five i which is a complex solution here then here also we have x equals to five i which is also a complex solution here and starting from the second case here, yeah, which is x square minus 5 square equals to 0. This also follows when we have a square minus b square, which is the same thing as a plus b into bracket, open bracket, a minus b. That this here. Yeah, what we have becomes x minus 5 or x plus 5 first into bracket x minus 5 close bracket equals to 0 here that is here also we have two possible cases first on x plus 5 equals to 0 or we have x minus 5 equals to 0 then here this gives us x equals to minus 5 which is a real solution here and then here you are x equals to 5 which is also a real solution here which implies we have two real solutions and two complex solutions making four solutions together when we write it out here then you can say we have the first solution x one 
and that's equals to 5. Also, we have x2 equals to minus 5, the first two resolutions, and we have x3 equals to 5i, then x4 equals to minus 5i. Four solutions together, 2 re and 2 complex. Then when we check here, we substitute the value of x into the given problem. And this for x equals to 5, the equation becomes 5 over 5 times 5 over 5. Is this the cost to also here becomes 5 over 5 times 5 over 5. Then here 5 over 5 is 1. Then times also 5 over 5 we have 1. Is this the cost to this side as well? 5 over 5 does 1 times. 5 over 5 does 1. And also 1 times 1 gives us 1. Which is equals to 1 times 1 does 1. Which implies left hand side equals to the right hand side. Then 5 here satisfy this given problem. Then also we substitute minus 5 into the equation. That is, yeah, this becomes minus 5 over 5 times minus 5 over 5. Is it equals to 5 over minus 5 times 5 over minus 5? The minus 5 over 5 is minus 1 times also minus 1. Is it equals to 5 over minus 5? Also, we have minus 1 times minus 1. A minus times minus is plus, 1 times 1, that's 1. Equals to here, yeah, also, minus times minus plus, 1 times 1, 1. We also have left hand side equals to the right hand side. Then, x equals to minus 5, satisfy this given problem. We also substitute 5i. Then what we have here becomes, 5i over 5 times 5i over 5 is it equals to 5 over 5i times 5 over 5i. Then here 5i over 5, we can write that as i times also i. Is it equals to 5 over 5i? That's same thing as 1 over i times also 1 over i. Then i times i, that's i square. Is it equals to here? 1 times 1, 1 over i times i, i square. And we should note that i square, same thing as minus 1. That is, here we write minus 1. Is it equals to 1 over minus 1? And this is minus 1. It is equals to 1 over minus 1 is minus 1. Left hand side equals to the right hand side that is 5i also satisfy this given problem then we substitute minus 5i as well then this equation becomes minus 5i over 5 times minus 5i over 5 is it equals to 5 over minus 5i times 5 over minus 5i? Then here, this becomes minus i times minus i. Is it equals to here we have 1 over minus i times 1 over minus i? Then minus times minus is plus i times i, that's i squared. Is it equals to here as well? 1 times 1, 1. The minus i times minus i, that's i squared. And since i squared is minus 1, here we have minus 1. Is it equals to 1 over minus 1? And this is minus 1, which is equals to 1 over minus 1 is minus 1. Left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, minus 5i also satisfies this given. Okay. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos. Turn the notification bell on. Share this video. Give it a thumbs up and put your comments. See you next class and bye for now.